you want to be a part of? You know, it's funny. I, as a kid, I've always been obsessed. Like, like Mr. Uh, Bulgari, he was in his speech. He was talking about, um, you know, uh, all of the, his fascination with film and gems. And those are two things that I was obsessed with as a kid. I used to watch old movies, movies in the 30s and 40s and 50s. And um, I grew up watching those uh, old films. That's what made me want to be an actress. And the glamour and the lighting and the costumes and the jewelry was all a part of that. And um, and then I, as I, you know, I had a gemstone tumbler at my house. I would try it. I was like, I want to be able to create these things when I was like 10. And then uh, as I grew up, when I went to college, I had a, my sweet mate had a subscription to Town and Country. We would just tear through the pages, drooling over all the jewels. So, and of course, Bulgari is an iconic jeweler, and um, so it's just it's a dream to be able to wear these uh, beautiful jewels and come here and and uh, and, and help honor uh, Mr. Bulgari tonight. And um, yeah. Lastly, for me, um, as far as the jewelry goes, did yeah. you build the outfit around Oh, yes, absolutely. We built it around. This is just a cover-up, but we built it around the piece. Yeah. What did you love about this piece in particular? I love just, it's it's hard to tell, you know, when you see something in a magazine or in a flat server, like the, the brilliance of it, but it's got, it's just so decadent and it's got every different color gem and it's just and then the pearls so it's got this sparkle and of the sapphires and the diamonds but then also the warmth of all of the pearls so it's just it's heavenly I feel like you know I'm honoring uh, every uh, other you know fabulous like movie star and, and as well as Mr. Bulgari tonight so